Hello and welcome back to DH Play Part 24 of Resident Evil HD Remaster. Uh, my name is Partless Crime, and last time we was a little bit stuck on where to go. Um, yeah, as you can see, the only thing there's not really any new doors available. There's nothing that we can actually work our way through. However, there was something that I forgot. There was something that I forgot. So. And it was overnight while I was thinking about this. Like, what the fig is missing? So I forgot that we did a room with two walls that were sliding about. We had to push the statue to the end, and there was a hole. And we said, if we get stuck, we're going to come back and investigate that hole. I think now's the time. So let's go and check out the hole. I think it's this way, anyway. There's a whole. Oh, what does this paintings look like? No, can't click on them. Yeah. There you go. Right, there's a hole here. You can't see very far into the into. Though, go down the hole. Yeah. <laughs> What's down here? Is this the missing book? Eagle of South Wolf and North. Well, that's Volume One. Okay, well, last time we had one of those. <coughs> Let's read this first. November 29th, 1967. I can't get out. I have tried every possible way to escape, but only to be faced with the reality that I am trapped. I've been everywhere. The laboratory with the large glass tubes filled with formaldehyde and those dark, wet and eerie caves. What can I do? At first I didn't want to believe my eyes, but that familiar high-heeled shoe in the corridor, it was like reflex. One name came to mind, Jessica. I don't want to believe they share the same fate as me. No, I can't give up hope. I have to hope they're alive. November 30th, 1967. I haven't had anything to eat or drink for the past few days. I feel like I'm going crazy. Why is this happening to me? Why do I have to die like this? I was too obsessed with designing this ghastly mansion. I should have known better. November 31st, 1967. It was a dark and damp underground tunnel and another dead end. But even in the darkness, something caught my eye. Carefully, I lit the last match. I had to see what it was. The grave. But deeply engraved into the stone was my name. George Trevor. That's pretty creepy. At that instant, it all became clear to me. Those bastards knew from the beginning that I'd die here, and I fell right into their trap. But it's too late now. I'm losing it. Everything is becoming so far away. Jessica, Lisa, forgive me. Because of my ego, I got both of you involved in this whole damn conspiracy. Forgive me. May God justify my death in exchange for the, for safety. George Trevor. Thanks, George. A <coughs> name is carved into the small gravestone. George Trevor. There's a switch. Press it. Huh. Okay. Just to be 100% certain, there's nothing else here, right? Just move my mouse. I don't think it's recording the mouse, but just in case, I'm going to move it out of the way. Right, so the last time that we found one of these books, it had the last book, Volume 2. It had a medallion in it. So I'm, I'm hoping that this one's got a medallion in it. <laughs> what does it say? Eag Eagle of South Wolf and North. The last one said... Actually, I don't know what the last one said. What can the words on the cover mean? It says something like that, Eagle of South, Wolf and North, but it, it obviously it was Volume 2. 
Okay, so what you have to do is go to the pages like this and then open it. Yay! There's a medallion here. Medallion was hidden inside the book. Yay! We've got the medal of the eagle. Found inside the last book, volume one. Is there a special way to use it? I don't know. I have these two. How many I need, I don't know. But I have two of them now. And. Excellent. <laughs> I don't know what to do with them, but still. Uh, was there anything else? No, that's all though. But at least we have something. We can do something with something. Where does this lead to? Where are we now? We are... Oh! This might come up into the kitchen. Oh no, it's a new area. Let's just explore. Oh dear. I don't really have anything to fight this fucker. I really don't want him here either. Maybe we just sneak past him. Yeah, Mr. Spider. I don't want to fight you. Oh, there's a couple of them. Fuckers. Something to pick up. No, because they were spitting acid and everything. Fucking how many of them are there? There's one above me as well. Nothing down here but... Oh, shotgun shells. If only I had the shotgun! <laughs> Inside the cardboard box lies the discarded shell of a molding spider. Discarded shell of a molding spider. Oh, God, leave me alone! You never did that before. Oh. You never did that before. How come they're so feisty? And it hurts. Don't maybe set you on fire, spider. Shit, he is fucking tricking it up, isn't he? Oh, fuck off, spider. Shit. What the hell does this lead to? God. Okay, so this... Ah, this leads back into that room. I want to say excellent, but not really. Something's, something's here, but I don't know what it is. Okay, I have a red herb, but... And a blue herb, even though I have plenty of those. But now I have Deverage picking anything up. Shit, I don't know to fight this fuckers with me though! Right, the only thing that I can do is headshot ya. Sorry. All I got. I do have a dagger. Shit. Aim! Aim properly! That's my canteen looking. Empty! Run! <laughs> uh, yeah, so I'll do that. If only I'd have brought the shotgun, I actually wouldn't have been able to pick up nothing else. Yeah, I could have put one of the bullets over there. Uh, no! Wait, where did I just come from again? Down there? Oh, okay. So now we have options. You can either... Something from there. Don't want to go there yet. Here. There's a number of small objects on the shelf. Looking closer, you know it's the seal of Raccoon City on a broken dish. Who gives a fuck? You unlocked it. Okay, great. I don't need to go in it, but now it's unlocked. Happy about that. Oh, ammo. Excellent. Raccoon nose is itching. I only have one way to go, and that's this way. Something's on the floor. Down here? Yep, taking that. Looks like there's a battery here. Looks like the power supply for the elevator. 
main fuse is blown out. Switch over. Power supply appears to be functioning again. Okay, so now I can use the elevator, is that right? I think that's right. Fucker. Gotta beat him back to the entrance. All that time the power is actually right next to <laughs> right next to here. Took me a long ass time to get down to here. He's already dead. Use the elevator, yeah. Come on, then use it. Where do you think it's gonna take me? I wonder if we can select what floor to go on, as I feel that. Oh, we're in the room that we wanted to get to all along. Okay, excellent. There's some bullshit going on here. Oh, you fuck. Thank you, son. If you get up. That looks like you're probably gonna. This should unlock the doors. I was broken. It doesn't look like it'll open. Okay, maybe it doesn't. Not really worried about that. We don't need to go in there. We do kind of need to look at this shit. Am I poisoned? I am cautioned. Fortunately, I can't actually pick any of that up. All it's going to do is do that over and over again. I think I'm going to paint him, unfortunately. So, what else do we have in this room? Well, we can go and check out the corridor, and there's a secret room there, which... You know, maybe it's got something like a typewriter. There is a beast in here somewhere. I can hear it growling. There he is. Come on, then. Fight me around here. Right, I'm gonna blow your head off. <laughs> and that's how you take care of zombies. Let's reload. Rip, rip. Reload. Okay, so a damaged statue of a goddess. Great. Super smashing, lovely great. Right, unlocked it. We don't need to go through it, I just wanna unlock it. I know where that leads to. Where does this lead to? Great, more stuff that I can't use. Oh, there's a battery. Why the fuck do I need that battery? I'll take that. Okay, so there's a whole bunch of shit here that I, I just need to go and clear up some space for. So how much space do I actually need? I definitely need the battery. Without a shadow of the doubt, I need the battery. And I'm thinking that I need two spots for that. So that's three. Three spaces that I'm gonna need. Also, we've got three plants, so that's six spaces I'm gonna need. Now, how far away from, from anything useful am I? Like a, ah, actually, not that far. I can just pop out that door and pop next door. I'm gonna go do that. Now there is a dude here, but hopefully if I, if I bust the left real quick, I should be okay. Excellent. Now. Sadly, there are frogs. 
and I don't have anything to fight him, so I'm gonna have to be evading the fuck out of him. Oh, I is, throw a rabbit in the fuck out of the fuck. Oh, I got lost. But he's not in any mood for a frog. No frogs right now, please. Whoa. <laughs> Fuck it, frog. Gee, for a gee. Right. Open the goddamn. Yeah, there you go. How many ribbons do you have? I just want one saving it now. Only one. Only one. I'm gonna put that. Actually, I'm gonna put that next to this one. And I'll put that disc down here and then the crank there. I'm so obsessive when it comes to things like this. Alright, let's equip the shotgun because, god damn it, we need some kind of protection. And these things, put next to the plants, blue herb, put that one next to there, and red herb, there, red herb there. Okay, so extra bullets, don't need right now. That's going to be there, so we're going to have four spaces. I'm hoping that's going to be enough. The black grenade lamp uh, range too, but it's only around the corner, isn't it? So let's combine that with that. And you know what? I could probably. I don't want to get rid of this now. I like carrying these about. However, it is empty, and there's no way to refill it. So why don't we just. For the purposes of this mission, pop it back. Now we're good to go, but we need to be all shotgunned up. Okay. Deep breath, everybody. I wanna rock! Let's go. Right, froggy woggy. Ain't no, new, no move for no rabbits. Oh god. Oh god, Mr. Frog. That's right, you walk as slow as you can. It did bust me up a bit there. But the stealth that I can pick up here, stealth hard, that's what I meant. And there's a battery, I'm so happy about that battery. Because this episode's going so well, we've got the battery, we've got the... Oh, we'll go over that. We've got some stuff that we need, haven't we? The press. Okay. Acid shells. Shotgun ammo. Fuck yeah. Battery. Hit <coughs> oh, Excuse me. Had a little bit of a bit of a sniffle there. Oh dear. Slots, excellent. Okay, so that's everything. Now, if I go back and save this, yeah, I probably am going to lose some health and some ammo, unless I run. So I'm going to combine this with this, and I've got something to combine that with, but I don't think I'm poisoned, so I'm going to just take this. Get back to fine. Have the shotgun. 
I have the battery, but where do I have to go for the battery? See, if I save it down there... I'm going to have to go a long way to the battery, aren't I? See, I can go back down into the basement, but I don't see that that's actually going to help me at all. Because that's only going to bring me into here, isn't it? Get there much quicker. Going a different way, right? <coughs> In order to get to <sighs> okay, okay, so. We decided not to save it. <laughs> okay, we're gonna brave it. We're not saving it. I know that it hasn't worked out that great for us before. We have nice weapons now. We have ammo. We have all the items we need. And I think we're gonna need to progress. I'll try and get as much done in this episode as we possibly can. So, I'm gonna just go for it. I want to go, what a go with it. It shouldn't be that hard for us to do. All we gotta do is go through the secret door. Hoping there's no frogs down here. Fuck, fuck, fuckity fucking fuck pan. I didn't bring the fucking medallion, did I? I forget which one it is as well. <sighs> the good thing is that I have this this room here. The bad thing is that I can't get back to that immediately without fucking right. that one, I think it's this one. No, it's not that one. It's this one. The other one needs a surround, I think. I'm pretty sure it's this one. I'd be surprised if it's not. Should I be risking it? Well... as well to risk this, but they already have the slot for these anyway, might as well put the gun there, right? This is going to be gone as well, so I haven't really lost anything. Okay, let's get there as quick as we can to get rid to, uh, to where it was, and I think the quickest way, sadly, is to get back to the front room again. It 
Seems kind of unfair, but hey. Or does that lead anywhere? No, it doesn't. It doesn't. I'd have to go all the way around. No, just have to try and avoid this one right now. Ouch. Okay, he did hit us. Did he hurt us? No, he didn't. Of course so. My own dumb asshole for not forget forgetting that medallion. Medallion? Whatever the f What is it? Object. Forgetting the object. Please tell me if it's with the right one. It pissed me off that we've got to go back and get the other one. <laughs> yeah, I think I did because the other one doesn't fit in the door downstairs, whereas this one did both times. Yeah, that one fits in there. Excellent. But I cannot remember which way it was. I think it was this way. This is Brad. If you can hear me, just give me a sign. Who the fuck Anything. is Brad? Jill to Brad. Can you hear me? Shit. It's broken. Well, who the fuck is Brad, Jill? Huh? Look at fire and then walk. I can't remember. I might have come the wrong way. Maybe. haven't. I've still got that crank. I'm going to have to use it for something. But sooner or later, I'm going to have to go back and get the crank. Oh, this fucking snake. Do they hurt? Let's check see if the snakes actually hurt. They fucking do. Fucking snake. Good news is I came the right way. Some kind of transparent creature is swimming around. In the water. The power to the elevator isn't turned on. Gotta be a power source. In somewhere. Battery has been taken out. Yes, we want to use the battery. Blah. Collect it up then. Oh, it's been restored. I want to know how to get through here. Well, I guess it'll make sense when it makes sense. Let's go up in this elevator, see where it takes us. Somewhat interesting, hopefully. Maybe my luck it'll just be a fucking shortcut to somebody. It's just a shortcut to somewhere. Man. That's all that is. It's just a shortcut.
that's frustrating. Unless there's like something underneath the elevator, which I highly doubt. I'm gonna go back and check anyway. Oh for fuck's sake, there's fucking snakes. Why is, why is this one blocked off now? That's some bullshit. The elevator can only work once at one at a time. I suppose that is true, yeah. Doesn't make sense, doesn't it? No help, slow caution there, I'm alright. Okay, well that didn't do anything like I thought it was going to do. She's a bastard. Still. I can find him with no water coming out. Okay. Okay. <laughs> That was really hard to find, mate. I thought it was going to do something. I thought it was going like, to lower a drawbridge over to the, the fountain or something. Or take us to a secret room. No. Didn't do anything. Alright then folks, that will be the end to uh, episode 24. We actually got a lot done. We got the um, medallion, the uh, eagle medallion. I'm not sure how many medallions there are, whether there's more than two or whether two is enough. Or we'll have to look at that next episode. We got that, we got the battery, even though the battery turns out that <laughs> really wasn't as good as we thought it was going to do. We've unlocked most of the doors and we've got the elevator working now. And I don't really see what else we have to do. I mean. There isn't really anything to do. You know, we've pretty much got everything done. Anyway, we'll figure it out next time on uh, DH Play of HD Remaster of Resident Evil. I've been Fighting Miss Crime, and I'll see you in episode 25.